This afternoon we were with Kevin Lovell at the Reef Shack sitting in Kent, that's in England, for any international viewers. And I'm going to ask Kev a few questions about how he ended up running a fish shop. And how did you get started in fish keeping then? I originally started with a Siamese fighter fish in a little fish bowl and then progressed onto a bigger tank for that. Eventually ended up with Malawi's for a couple of months. Took the leap, went for Marines and never looked back since. Ended up with a house full of tanks and, and now I've got a shop. Do you still have an aquarium at home then, Kev? No, when I set up the business, I was working down here in the day and doing my normal job, which was a printer at night. So I had no spare time. So I broke the tank down, used all the water and some of the stock to seed the system to get it started. So how long has the shop been now been running then, Kev? The shop's been running about a year and three months, I think. Have you been busy? Uh, yeah, it's been really good, actually. Yeah, yeah, surprisingly. What's the rarest fish or coral you've had so far in the shop? The rarest fish I've probably had would be a long-nosed black tang. And the rarest coral I've got in the shop, I would say, would be the rainbow halia that I've got in my display. And I think we'll video a little bit of that later for people to see, because that's rather nice. Looks like you specialise quite a lot. What's that? The main speciality here? I try to do a bit of the different stuff that most shops don't do. Quite a big selection in the SPS and try and get some some of the rare LPS in, some of the nice acans and scollies and just a different variety of things really. And talking about the systems here, there's a fair few of them. So what methods do you use to run them? Just your basic system really, uh, just a calcium reactor large sump. We used to run Cheeto but had trouble with it, keep breaking up. So just keep it simple really, live rock based calcium reactor, large skimmer, T5 lighting. It's just pretty simple basically. Dose a few elements and that's about it. And all the systems run the same or do you run some of them slightly differently? No, they all pretty much run the same, yeah, yeah. Keep it nice and simple and it's easier to, to trace a problem if you get one. Are there any other services that you offer to your customers, like maintenance or...? Uh... Yep, yep, I do do a bit of maintenance. Also, people that buy tanks from me, I go out and do the installs and whatever for them. Get them started, I do free water testing and whatever, and if they've got any problems, I often visit their house and see, uh, see if I can get to the bottom of it. And do you do any mail order at the moment? A bit, not, not too much, a little bit, but I'm going to look into it in the new year and trying to do a bit more. Thanks for having us and letting us have a look around your store. Thanks a lot, Kev. No worries. Thank you for coming.